Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. It's Shrogs, and today I just want to go over uh, some tips and see a thieves on how to never sink again when you're in a sloop. Now here I'm soloing Flameheart in my sloop, so I don't have anyone helping me. And I got really close to sinking, but I ended up saving my ship in a spot where I think most people probably would have sunk. Um, so I just want to go over some things. I always see a lot of people asking pretty newish questions in the CFDs Reddit because we are getting so many new players, especially with this being on Game Pass and it constantly be going on sale, that I thought a quick tutorial on how to keep your ship afloat would be beneficial. So enjoy the video. So here my ship is full of water, I'm about to sink. So the most important thing to do is to bail water. Now here I almost sink myself because the water I'm throwing through this window is hitting the window cover and it was actually putting it back in my ship. So if you're ever about to sink, just throw it off the back end like I am right now. It's going to be your safest option. So I'm gonna keep bailing water until I've bought myself enough time to put wood up, but I realize that I'm about to sail into two more ships, one of them being a lieutenant, so it has more firing power. And so I need to drop my anchor really quick or else I'm gonna sail into them and they actually do end up hitting me a few times. So really I just keep bailing water to buy myself time. It's the most important thing you can do. So I bail water to buy enough time to drop the anchor. Then I bail water to buy myself enough time to put some wood up. And going below deck here, remember to scoop a bucket of water. You don't have to dump it, but then pull your wood out. This is gonna lower the water levels and prevent it from getting too high and slowing your movement speed. As long as you're bailing water, it's going to be very hard to sink because even if I had about seven holes, I could probably bail water faster than it's gonna sink me. So just realize that's the best thing you can be doing in any situation where your ship's going down. Now, I do have fire and it was kind of least of my concern because fire doesn't really sink ships. It's, it takes a long time to sink to fire. Uh, but I am using the water that is just flooding my ship to put the fire out. If there is no water in the bottom of your ship because you haven't been taking hits, then you would have to use the water barrel at the bottom and manually pump water in. So you can kind of save a hole. I can keep a hole in my ship on purpose so that way I can quickly run down and grab water off the bottom of my boat. Now, fire should be your last concern when doing this. Uh, it's pretty hard to sink to it. It's more of just going to damage your health. Here I see some barrels. You don't have to do this, but I just shoot one up. It has a bunch of cannonballs in it, and I just leave it there for now. I can get that later. It's just going to sit there on my harpoon. And then I'm just going to get these last couple holes now that the fire is out. And I'm completely out of danger at this point from the ship shooting me. So I'm feeling pretty good. But there are a few more repairs to make that you always want to check. A lot of people miss this. So you're going to want to repair the mass of your ship because if this takes three hits, it goes down and then you can't sail. And here it had taken two hits, so I quickly repair those. And then the last thing to repair is the steering wheel. Sometimes you'll need to repair your anchor as well. Those can get the handles can get shot off but mine doesn't have any damage to it so these are just a couple things that are least priority on the repair list because repairing those isn't going to keep your ship from sinking so but you want to make sure that you get those repaired after your ship has been repaired up on the bottom deck that way your mast doesn't just fall down when you're in the next fight and you end up taking a lot of hits all right, guys, I hope you learned something. I hope you enjoyed the video. I just want to thank you guys for 200 subscribers. I'm working on my 200 subscriber video right now. I actually did filming all day yesterday, and then all the film, there was something wrong with it, so I had to delete it all. So it's probably going to be a few days before that comes out. The next couple of things of content I'm going to make are going to probably be Apex Legends related, just because I haven't done that in a while, and I want to keep making content for that game as well. So anyways, thanks guys. I really appreciate all of your support and feedback. So, so I will see you guys in the next video and until then take care.